Can you add me one? Uh, have you? Um, <laughs> have oh, this is a big rough. That's a diamond rough, baby. Yeah, Uni, you're my good luck charm. You made me put my good luck. I'm wearing this blonde wig forever, honey. I'm not taking this wig off. You got. We're going out in public like this. Sorry. This is, uh, I'm a blonde and I like diamonds. I'm a blonde and I like diamonds. I know. I know it's cliche. All right. But I like diamonds. That's tied for record, but the score. Oh, uh, why is my score low? A small line I got to use. Dude, I'm using a two pound line. Do I got to use a one pound line? Welcome back to the channel, everyone. My name is Dar Sloan, your official partnered content creator for Expansive Worlds, and we are out here today putting a little line in the water, trying to catch us a big wampus cat rough. Let's see what got us a bite of something right here. We got. We're using a tin hook today with the blood worm, and there's our first rough, which is a silver point one six, and you may be thinking. Man, that's small, and that's because it is. Saw our diamond there, beginning of this video, went three five. That's actually, at that time, was tied for the community record. So, may have been beaten since then. But uh, we didn't get a great score because I wasn't using a small enough hole. Apparently, there's another rough. They are very fast little fellers. And we're going to be looking at a few spots today. I'll take you to my favorite spot where I caught mine, which is Magic Pond. No secret. But you want to be using a tin hook, guys, and here's why. If you've noticed, I noticed this right off the bat. When you drop down to a nine hook, I wasn't catching any rough. And I was like, what in the world's going on? Come to find out, first species that we've had to deal with in this way and thank you so much for Wilson and Lenny and whoever else was involved with updating it but we've never had to deal with a fish that had a split like the tin hook is bronze and silver okay we've always had it like divided or not divided but bronze and silver now once you go to the nine hook that's gold and diamond or rough actually for three of the species for the bullheads as well the dice eight is silver nine and ten is bronze probably our lewis's favorite spot if i had to guess we are up here in in this area up here next to this trailhead uh, which is a good european perch green spot northern pike all right there's another nice rough of 0.19. They look a little bigger than what they weigh, you know. They are fast little boogers, and they don't nibble. They're aggressive, so you gotta be, you gotta be on your game, you know. Catching these little things, but I like using a blood worm. Now, occasionally you're gonna get bothered by roach and things like that, but I need a diamond roach, so. But the blood worm, all four of the new species will hit on that blood worm. You're going to catch some dice up here. You're going to catch some rough. I still need the dice of the diamonds. So I'm okay with that. Guys, we've moved on out here to my second location. This is actually spot two on the official angler discord. We will look at that map here in a little bit as well. I have personally never fished here, but this is where Jaxi showed us. When he first revealed the rough to us in his tackle box stream. So we are right here on the map, as you can see, right out from the starter outpost. Known diamond rough spot. Alright guys, we've got us one on right here. I couldn't see it nibble. I don't know if it is a rough or not, but it did not nibble at all. So it's not a roach. Hopefully this is a rough. It is. That's a nice rough. 0.21. Nice 
And let's move on to my flavor it spot and where I caught my diamond. Yes, I did say flavor it. Um, on purpose. On the perp. Let's go right here. Favorite spot. Favorite spot right here. This is Magic Pond. A lot of people have asked, where is Magic Pond? I wish our trailheads were named. But Magic Pond is below this island. You see the very first island here. You got or the very first lake. You got this island straight down right here. Magic Pond. This is Magic Pond. So looks like we got ourselves a roach right here. Magic Pond is called that because you can get, but you can get a Diamond Xander, Burbot, Ruff, Bream, Pike, Dace, Roach, and Asp. There's eight different diamonds that you can get out of Magic Pond right there. My dime, I got my Diamond Xander here. I got my Diamond Ruff here. I got Northern Pike Diamond here. All right, guys, here we have ourselves a rough, and that looks like a good one. Be wrong. It's hard to tell. That is a good one. Point one nine is a good rough. We just move down here just a little bit. Just keep moving around until you can, uh, you know, I was on that other rock. I like to stand on these rocks so I can get up a little bit and see. But just keep casting. You can also catch the rough on the other side of the dock over there and the dace they're all up and down these banks right here now the dace also here's another one the dace also is uh toward that i don't know if you call that a waterfall uh, not really a waterfall but where that water's running straight ahead there i've seen a lot of diamond gaze there uh dace caught there there's a 0 0.20 rough so heating up here catching a few rough they're real real schooly so once you start finding them you should get a few bites and you, you just have to keep kind of moving up and down the bank. Catch you a few. End up on the other side of that dock over there once the lights kind of slow down a little bit. Guys, we've got another little guy swimming over right now. Right in the middle of the lake, so I guess uh, don't have to cast near the bank if you don't want to. So we were casting right out in the middle there. We've got a sub-bronze rough right there. Let's see where we're at on the map here, guys. Love this spot. It's very convenient to go to. As you can see here, there's a fast travel point right there. You just walk right over here, cast in. You can look at all the different fish, guys, and see how many you have caught of each one. And the rough, we caught 110, so I have one diamond out of 110. Now, I may have caught a few more rough after we caught that dime, but roughly about 110. Now, you can see some of the others I got a little lucky on. Alpine Bullhead, 12. European Bullhead 22, and I have a dime of each of those. We still do not have a common dace as of the making of this video, and I've caught 194. So that's just how the luck of the draw is. A lot of people have several dace at this point. Guys, as you can see here, there are seven locations that you can catch the rough at. We are currently at location number four. We have been to number two. Number three is Magic Pond, and number one is where we started out at. We have not been to six, five, or seven, so you guys can let me know your experiences at those spots. But again, we're using a 10 hook. We're using blood worm. Please do me a favor, guys. Hit that like, subscribe, and notify bell. Let me know in the comments what videos you would like to see next. How have you been doing with the four new fish? Do you have any dimes? Which ones do you still need? This is my rough diamond guide. <laughs> Diamonds rough. <laughs> okay, I'll shut up. Anyway, guys, hope this helped. Hope that you can get your diamond rough and I really like putting the blood worm on and going to Magic Pond because I think I might end up getting me an accidental on purpose roach diamond or you know maybe even a bream who knows but hope this video helped guys we'll catch you in the next video